adventures in Japan. Oh, wonderful people. What are you looking for? Does this look familiar? Well, greetings from Universal Studios Japan. The last time I was here, there was a lot of scary people trying to overtake the park. But now there's just like a scary fat guy that's trying to give people presents. I mean, that, that's scary it, it, just on your perception. I mean, if a guy came up to you, take this present, you'd be scared too. And also now, the skyline includes a giant Christmas tree. Well, holy crap, does this park switch themes very fast. It was just Halloween. And there it is, the only surviving Terminator ride in all the world. Except it's in Japanese. USJ is becoming the museum of all the Universal Studios. You can see all the attractions that don't exist anymore. It'd be a true museum if Back to the Future was here, but you know, they like making money. If I was here three or four months ago, this is where the giant globe used to be. Like they, they just repaved this whole sidewalk because the giant globe that used to be in this area has been turned into a sitting park area, which have a, was a park already, but they just completed it and put chairs, mostly for this show. From right here, if you look at the Terminator building, you'll see some scaffolding on the top of that building. They have a show here called Voice of an Angel, and at the end of the show, they bring up people on those uh, lifts. Basically, they lift them up in the air, and they're supposed to be angels floating in the air. It's a really impressive setup for their Christmas show. When it's not windy, they actually bring out drones, too, that light up this giant monster of a tree. It's so big, it's got the Guinness World Record certificate of it or at least to have the most lights on an artificial tree. It was observed on the 26th of October. Wait a minute, they started Halloween before, 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 they started Christmas before Halloween? Well, I'm so flabbergasted I can't even finish the scent. In fact, that show is so popular, even though it starts around five o'clock, people are waiting right now at two o'clock to get the best seat for that show. People seriously wait a very long time out here in Japan, kids. Well, you know it's Christmas when a shark has a reef around it. Spelled not R-E-F-F, -F, but you know, the other reef. It's very difficult. English is a hard language for me. The ironic thing is that Jaws is closed for renovation right now. So Jaws is not present. Toko, you're here too. Hey, how you doing, Toko? That was a, that was a joke. See, present. Oh, Christmas. Wow. Yeah. Just exiting Amity and in the Jurassic Park area, they have construction walls up. Question is, why do they have construction walls up? Maybe because of the ride, maybe the netting, I don't know. It definitely looks like it has nothing to do with the Super Nintendo construction though, which is happening right over there. Oh, that looks really good. Our 500 yen is a little much. Count this down as something I've never seen before. If you're an annual pass holder, you can get half off beer. But they are pretty organized here, so you have to queue up. And there lies the most magical thing in the world. Beer! It comes with a little tray that you have to put it in. Because if you don't put it here, it might fall over. People will be shocked and awed and amazed of your amount of beer. This place is a heck of a lot bigger than the one in Orlando. Everything's looking a little better now. You know, a good friend of mine once said, the world is a vampire. Set the drain, and if you spend your Christmas drinking things like this, boy oh boy, your world will become a vampire. That was smashing pumpkins, that wasn't my friend. My God, Toko, I have finished it. Whoa, uh, oh, that's not as impressive as I thought. You, you stay an abstinent on this one? Yep. Because that's what you say when you don't drink, you stay abstinent, right? That's what we learned in my schools. You stay abstinent, you don't, it means you don't so drink. Much. It means you stay so abstinent, right? That, that's Absent? What? Absinthe is another kind of drink, isn't it? What? Though the entirety of Universal Studios Japan seems to be covered in Christmas colors, there's one place that Christmas seems to be like an unholy festival of light, and that's in the Harry Potter area, because even the Pope said that Harry Potter was okay. It wouldn't be Christmas without some vehicular homicide. But yes indeed, they seem to have the Christmas decorations up. Togo, 
this is your first time here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've never seen the Wizarding World of Harry Potter before, no. right? No. But you like the books, right? I think I read up to the sixth one. I didn't read the seventh one. Yeah. Well, if it's Toko's first time here, we gotta give him a butter beer. It's good. I like it. How would you describe it? Um, carbonated buttermilk. So they brought the Christmas tree back. If you're a wizard or a witch, you can actually make the ornaments go up and down. And if you're here at night, you can actually light up the tree. Yes, if you come out to the Wizarding World of Harry Potter, you too can do parlor tricks. Hey Toko, the castle looks great, doesn't it? Yeah. That's the reflection, stupid. That's the real castle. Oh, you still you got you're looking down, man. Fooled me once, shame on me. Fooled me twice, shame on you. <laughs> is that was that a Bushism? No, that's oh. a, a Japanese proverb. Oh yeah, Klingon. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got some like ghee on on your face right there. <laughs> you go. Since it's Stoker's first time, I figured let's go on the Harry Potter ride. However, the line is 120 minutes long. So I was like, oh, let's just do the cast tour because we can come anytime we want. Well, let's go. This guy's pointing to where the bathroom is. It's that way. That's the uh, um, uh, founder of uh, House uh, the Slytherin. And that's uh, the founder of Gryffindor. That's and that's where he was I'm impressed with all the British people that can speak uh, perfect Japanese, man. You know, for all these people decorating for Christmas, it looks like the houses decided to skip it. Gryffindor hates Christmas, everybody. Gryffindor hates Christmas. Gryffindor hates Christmas. Toko, I should have been saying the truth. They kicked us out. They kicked us out. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Like it or not, it looks like the holiday season is here, especially at Universal Studios Japan, in a country that is really non-Judo Christian. Toko, yeah. what do you think about all this? <laughs> well, it's pretty. It's pretty. But do you think anyone understands the message behind all this stuff? Like all these lights and all the, the religious subtext that's here? Well, it's, um, it's shiny. That's about what I think everyone else gets from it. However, there is a Harry Potter thing here that's for uh, Christmas. However, you have to have a ticket to go into Harry Potter right now, so it looks like we're skipping on that. But, as I always say, you can do it. I can do it. We can all do it. You guys stay groovy and have a wonderful day. Okay. Peace. Peace. Wow, you're, you're really good at this. <laughs> I can, I, I, I've done this video a couple of times. Just a couple of times. Oh, you're doing good. 